Hi YouTube. Quick video. This is what we're using for our insulation over our foundation wall. We got uh, two layers of two inch and one layer of uh, one inch. So we got 32 and change of uh, R value out there. You know, the block walls exposed completely in the back and uh, buried partially on the sides in the front. So um, there's no R value out here and the block just uh, bridges the cold through the wall and that space is now habitable space. So it's important for us to make it a comfortable space, um, an efficient space as far as heating and cooling. Um, so on this side, my neighbor's house is here. We didn't want to bring machinery so we dug it by hand and uh, kind of tricky with beach sand because it always falls back in on you as you're digging it but um, so we got one layer one layer of the one and two layers of the two and then what happens is the one is going to come meet the plywood and then the two goes all the way up the building meets the curb and then we have three that makes the five of five inches of thickness and then we seal coat it at the same time and uh, temporarily just packed it with some uh, masonry nails. But when we come over the whole thing with three, because the three shows the profiling, we're actually going to um, um, tap con in with some buttons because we'll be connecting everything up there with buttons and screws and down here with tap cons in the masonry. Anyways, we backfill for now. And uh, we still have to do a couple things to that foundation before we can start insulating the other sides because we got to cut in a door. We've got to reconfigure some windows back here. And um, before we start applying our insulation. But anyways, you can see we went right down to the footing. We've got to brush this off. And then what we do is we come and we coat it really good with the Henry's coating. And then we start applying our layers of insulation. And we stagger all our joints. And we come up with an R value a little bit over 32, which this block never had. Because, um, you know, the block acts like a big icicle. It's grabbing the cold and it just comes through the wall. So, But we'll still put some interior framing walls in there and we'll have some R values there but uh, to stop the bridging of the cold that's why we're insulating, insulating the exterior of the of the of this uh, home anyways that's it for now guys we're just showing you how how we get started on this and you can see the footing right there and when we dust this off really good, blow it off really good, because when we seal coat, we seal coat down on top of the, the footing in the block where they meet each other. Okay. And as you build up layers, what happens is the three inch is going to come meet this, but below the grade, because then grade comes and meets to the, to the exterior. That's it, guys. We'll share a couple more as we go, but that's the beginnings of our insulation of the foundation.